Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel! It's me, your crochet buddy, Maggie. So today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make a scrunchy ponytail. So I have my material here. I have like a, a lot of scrap yarn. So I'm going to use a size 5.5 hook or you can use any kind of any size of hook you want to use and then yarn scissor and of course a elastic band so I buy this at Walmart <laughs> so you can get this one so let's start so first you're going to tie your yarn on the ponytail. So make sure it's tight and it's secure. Some more. So next, you're going to do single crochet around the rubber band or the ponytail so by doing the single crochet it doesn't matter how many you can do it depends on the size of the ponytail or as long as you cover the color or the rubber band that you're using so we just do single crochet around the ponytail so just do single crochet around do as many as you can depend on the size of the rubber band that you're using so just do single crochet around so for me like what I told you it doesn't matter how many so I don't count how many single crochet I do just do single crochet and cover the ponytail so continue doing yours and I'm going to show you what we're going to do on the next round so I'm almost done so I forget to tell you guys at the beginning the one that we tie the extra one you need to uh, put them together so you while you're doing the single crochet you're covering that with that yarn so you need to tuck in that extra yarn that you use from the beginning to secure the ponytail so you can see I it's around here so I'm almost done just do single crochet around To slip stitch from the very very first single crochet that you do so that's your first round so try to make them flat so you will know that they not twisted so that's what it looked like so next round you're going to do chain two or chain one it depends on you and work half double crochet around the ponytail just half double crochet the same stitch that you do and work half double crochet around or each of the chain so you will 
you don't know how many you make and I don't know how many I make so just do half double crochet on each of the chain so if you're making like a small ponytail so maybe you're going to do a less than this one that we're making and also it depends on the hook that you're using if you're using a smaller hook so you're going to have a lot or more chain compared to what we're using I'm using now I'm using a bigger hook because I'm using a thicker yarn so it depends also if your yarn is a little bit uh, bulky like what I'm using so you using a bigger hook and if you're using a thinner yarn then you're going to use a smaller hook so it's really depend on the hook and the yarn that you're using so continue doing yours and I'll be back to you on our last row just do half double crochet on each of the chain okay happy crocheting so I'm on my last chain half double crochet and slip stitch on the next chain so that's what it's look like Next, the final row, you're going to do chain of two and you're going to make five double crochet on each of the chain. So you're going to do five double crochet on each of the chain. So five double crochet at the same stitch. Four. Oops. Oops. And five. So five double crochet at the same stitch. And then go back to the next. Another five double crochet. Two. Three. So you're doing that pattern over and over until you reach on the beginning and your scrouchy is done. <laughs> so just do five double crochet on each of the chain. So if you really want to make it really really bulky or scrouchy, you can make it six or seven double crochet on each of the chain. So I'm just doing five double crochet on each of the chain so this one that i make before it's kind of old i do this five five chain five double crochet in it. so just do that make five double crochet on each of the chain and i meet you what we're doing on the next round but this is our final round so we're just seeing our final result so happy crocheting five double crochet in each chain okay i'm on my last chain to do the five double crochet Four. And five. And then slip stitch at 
the next chain. And chain one and cut your yarn. So you can weave your yarn in and out on that top of that chain. Or if you want, you just can sew, sew them on the chain. So it doesn't matter how you close it, it's, it's your scrunchy. So you can do any style you want to close it. So I just doing this. Going to cut it later so you just do that back and forth back and forth So that's our finish product, our scrunchy. I hope you like it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and you can help my YouTube channel grow and for all, for all my subscriber, thank you, thank you so much for subscribing. I really really appreciate everything small heart love you love you all and to all my new new subscriber and to all the you guys that not just subscribing please 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 help me to grow my youtube channel by subscribing and sharing and like my video so happy crocheting thank you all everyone for watching god bless us all see you on my next video bye bye